Your Sway presentations are private to you unless you choose to share them. Share can be accessed at the top right hand side and you have a few options to choose from. The first option is specific people or groups. That means you can choose individual users in the Glow environment to view your Sway. You can also choose individual users in the Glow environment who may want to edit your Sway. This is useful if you want to collaborate on a Sway, possibly for a school newsletter. Or you might have groups of learners who are working in cooperative groups and they want to work on a Sway presentation together. However, I would recommend that you use those in your organisation with the link, which is the middle option. That means you don't need to enter any Glow email addresses. You only have to select those in your organisation with the link and then choose whether to give view only or edit access to your Sway. That means you can just then use the link that appears and pop that into an email. You can also get a visual link. So when you choose a visual link, you will get a nice visual representation of your Sway presentation. You can then copy that and pop it into an email. Alternatively, you might just want to leave it on the link and just select copy on the right hand side. You can also get the option to um, download an embed code. This is really useful if you want to embed your Sway presentation into a blog or a school website. Again, please make sure that you have all your permissions in place before sharing any information, especially if it involves learners and has pictures of learners. The last option is anyone with the link, so there is no Glow login required. Again, this is really useful for sharing on a school website or a blog and sharing with parents. So anyone with the link, so there's no Glow login required, can view your Sway. I would never click edit because you don't want anybody editing your Sway and you, if you don't know who they are. So anyone with the link, make sure you're on view and again, you can either copy that link Get a visual link, copy it, pop it into an email, or you can embed it into your school website. Lots of options. You'll also see their social media options in here as well. But again, please make sure your um, information is correct and you have permissions in place. There's also more options. With the more options, you can enable a password. So the users have to enter a password before viewing your Sway. By default, viewers can see the share buttons when they access your Sway, and this is useful if they want to share your Sway with colleagues. But again, please make sure that that's appropriate. You can then click reset the share settings and it'll go back to default.